What's up guys, Sinistalker here for a video. This right here, of a, and this video right here, a quick little fun little video of discussing the brand new Blu-ray box set of the Friday the 13th set has every movie in there. Even Freddy vs. Jason is in this set. Also a couple movie reviews I'm gonna do toward the end of this video. And it's time to talk about that and just some little random fun talks with Sinistalker. Oh yes, let's get down to it right about now. Before I begin the video, if you guys aren't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. Please subscribe, I'm about 125 or less away from hitting 13,000, so almost there. So if you guys are new to my channel, or you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe. It doesn't cost one red cent. And you get a little random stuff like me talking about stuff like this. <laughs> but yeah, I just want to put it out there like that. And uh, start off this video with so the Friday the 13th Blu-ray uh, box set by the Scream Factory line. It was announced today, today being Monday. And it starts selling like crazy. I think, it's, I think it's like it's almost sold out or something like that. And if you did a pre-order on it, you get a limited edition poster and lithograph. And what I did was like, it's like $150 plus like, you know, for shipping. So it's about like 172, I think, all together with taxes and stuff like that. So I pre-ordered mine. I, I normally never buy that crazy amount of stuff like that expensive for like a set, but I love Friday the 13th. My favorite franchise, the horror franchise of all time is Friday the 13th. Um, love that movie, love the franchise, love them, you know. Um, so you got all the movies, you know, starting from VHS, of course. You know, friggin' the old crappy NES game. I got that, you know, it's really hard. Um, I only had the Friday the 13th movies on DVD in this old school set put out like years ago. It has all the movies on there. And then like, the newest one I got was from, you know, Paramount. I got that, you know, the, the Blu-ray Steelbook Edition. It's the only Blu-ray I have on Friday the 13th. So I love the franchise. And it's like, you know what, I gotta jump on this because it's too good not to. It's gonna sell out probably. And it comes out October 13th, the street date of it. And my birthday is October 20th. So I figured, you know what, I'm getting an early birthday gift for myself. You know, I deserve it. Well, at least I think I do. So I <laughs> just wanted to get that for myself and just do it up like that. I cannot wait to check it out. Cause I don't know if I'm gonna get it for review or not. I might, I really don't know. It's possible I can get a review copy too. And if I do, then I'll maybe I'll have two or I'll sell the one and keep the other one. I really don't know, but I just wanted to get it just to be safe. And if there is, if there is review copies of it out there, they're probably really limited if there is gonna be any. So I was like, you know what? I did not want to miss this chance. I missed my chance a long time ago with the Halloween box set, that big old one. But the thing looks great. Let's show a picture of it right now, what it looks like. Really cool looking set. You have every movie on there with the 4K transfer, 2K transfers. Uh, new commentaries, new like behind the scenes stuff. It's like, it's like loaded up every movie on this thing. And you, 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 so you, get, you even get the remake, the Friday the 13th remake on this thing, which I didn't mind the remake. I thought the remake, remake was kind of cool for what it was. You get Freddy vs. Jason. You get two cuts of Friday, of, uh, Jason Goes to Hell, a rated and unrated version. Unrated version is way better, way more gorier. Friday vs. Jason. So it's a big collaborative effort from, uh, from uh, Shout Factory, Paramount Pictures, of course and then New Line Cinema later on. So that's why I don't know, I could get a review copy maybe from Paramount. I don't know how it's gonna really work. So, cause they're in cahoots with the whole thing too. I really don't know what's gonna happen with that. But, uh, so that's why I was like, you know what? I'm gonna bite the bullet, I'm gonna order this thing. Cause it's like, everyone started buying it up. I'm like, I gotta get this. I can't miss out on this cell. I will like hate myself if I didn't get this thing. So I'm like, I gotta get it, you know? And so definitely pumped up to uh, to get it and stuff like that. And I just want to know if you, if you guys are going to get this set. I don't know if, like, if you guys are going to, if you guys bought it earlier today or what, if you guys seen it yet and that kind of thing. But it looks loaded up. It looks really cool. Definitely excited about it. I can't wait to dive into it and see how these look like in brand new 4K, 2K transfers, Blu-ray. It's going to be it's a beautiful looking set. I just can't wait. And the, and the cool posters and lithograph that comes with it, if you get the, the pre-order of it, it looks pretty rad and that kind of thing too. It was I think it was like limited to like 1313, like 1313 posters and lithographs, but they sold out so quickly, they upped it to 7,000 limited only if you do a pre-order on it. So I jumped in then. And so who knows, um, that kind of thing. I know like the, the site was crashed and stuff earlier. It was like nuts. So thank God my order went through. I didn't get my confirmation uh, letter yet, but I did get my confirmation order number. So I'm all good there. The money, the money took it out of my account right away. So there was no delay in that. They want, they want that money right away. So I understand. So. They took out that, so I'm all set. So yeah, definitely excited about that set. It looks really, really rad. Like I said, love Friday the 13th. Can't wait to see this. It's gonna look beautiful on the shelf. It's you know, lined up right there. It's gonna look so sick. So I definitely can't wait to check it out and do a review of it and show you guys in depth of it when that comes out in a few months down the line, which I can't believe. It's gonna be a few months or so. It's October. What the heck? It's like, oh my God, and crazy times, crazy times with all the, 
stuff going on in the world too. It's like, whew. So it's just a crazy year of, of stuff. But the best thing out of 2020 so far is this Friday the 13th Blu-ray set. It's like the only thing I think it's like really good out of this year is that. But let me know in the comments below if you guys are, are gonna pick that up or if you're interested in it or whatnot like there. I know it's a little bit pricey, but you get a lot of movies for, for your buck and you get a lot of features in it. They're all remastered. It's like, gonna it's, it's look gorgeous. So yeah, definitely come to check it out. And now I have a couple of movie reviews here from the Paramount Pictures line. All right, I'm gonna start with this uh, 90s classic. I remember watching this back when I was a kid, like middle school, then high school. Loved it ever since. And it was it's the classic 25th anniversary edition of Clueless starring, you know, of course, beautiful Alicia Silverstone. She plays this rich girl, you know, in a school like Beverly Hills. It's like just crows in the background. <laughs> What's going on out there if you hear it? But yeah, so like, you know, it's just it's like great high school type thing of different stuff going on. You got great songs here by the Mighty Mighty Boss Tones and all, all, the, all the, the funny looks with the saggy pants. And like, you know, great cast, you know, uh, the late great Brittany Murphy's in this thing. You got Paul Rudd up in here, one of his first movies. Donald Faison. Stacey Dash, a bunch of people are in this thing. It's a great, great classic, fun movie is this. And this limited edition, really neat looking steel book put out by Paramount Pictures. This comes out July 21st, so be on the lookout for that. I'll show you the contents it looks like inside. And it's pretty much the same, um, the same stuff as the other original Blu-ray that came out. It's pretty much the same disc as this. So you're pretty much getting it for the cool steel book look of it. So let me take off a little sheet right up here, gently like that. And this comes with a digital code up in this thing. And then here's the contents of what it looks like on the inside. You can see right up over there. And I'll show you what it is. It's like this cool like pictures of um, the cast, you know. Like this cool like little photo looking, you know, collage. How that looks. It looks really, really rad. So I'll show you a better look of, the look of what it looks like in the back right there. And there is the spine, as you can see. It looks really nice. I like how the look of it is because it looks like, you know, the dress that she wears in the movie. One of her outfits. So yeah, it's a great fun one right there. You know, all the funny stuff, it's about suck and blow, as if, you know, all those the funny terms, you know. This is a great set, it looks great on Blu-ray, because I've never had it on Blu-ray before this, so it's really great for me. It comes with all kinds of extras in this thing, you get like behind the scenes, trivia game on this thing. All that kind of good stuff is loaded up in this uh, nice looking set. It's a great looking collector set, especially if you're into like, you know, this movie a lot, definitely get this definitive Steelbook limited edition set out July 21st, look at that. Just kind of pops. Love how that looks. Super good stuff. And the last movie I'm gonna uh, talk about right up here, coming up July 21st, also, which will be next week, is the uh, from the Paramount Presents line from 1990. This classic, which I always liked, this movie, uh, Ghost. Uh, great movie up here, starring Patrick Swayze, uh, the late great Patrick Swayze, and Demi Moore in this, uh, and also Whoopi Goldberg. And uh, this great movie. I'm sure you guys seen it before. This is a great looking set. Looks awesome on Blu-ray, great job it did. Extra features thing, I have a nice little interview with the, with the director of how they made the movie and stuff like that. I was talking some extras of it, some new stuff they put in this thing, this setup here. What I like too is you get this great looking gatefold up there of the original poster work. Check that out, looks awesome. And here's the back again, a little bit better detail. It's a great story about, you know, um, sad uh, romantic love story, a little bit of comedy in there too. As Patrick Swayze's character, him, him and uh, Demi Moore, you know, uh, couple they both move in together like in a nice loft and he's like he's like a, like a works at a bank of this business partner and one day after a theater about like they went to went to a theater date and stuff like that and he accidentally gets um shot and dies and becomes like this uh spirit but he doesn't know he's a spirit at first he's like what's going on then he, he realizes he's a ghost and he has to find a way to get he loves her so much he wants to find a way to like um just because the bad guys that killed him are going to go after her too and so he wants to find a way to, and see what happened to his death. He wants to, he finds out what, what, how he got killed. I'm gonna give it away. But he finds out like, why is he dead? Like, why did he get shot? And you know, they shot him for a horrible reason. It's just, it's just terrible. And so he's out there to find out um, who shot him in a sense, the, the, his murder and, you know, uh, avenge his soul. It's like a spirit, um, you know, kind of figuring things out. He meets uh, Whoop Whoopi Goldberg, who plays a spirit psychic called named Otome Brown. And uh, she's the only one that can really hear him. And so he talks to her to talk to Demi Moore and warn her about what's going on, about these bad guys and stuff like that. And maybe his spirit can have rest after he figures out all this stuff. And it's kind of this nice, great date movie is this. If you watch this with your girl or whomever, great one up here, great date night movie. A little sad, but but it's a good one to do. Definitely score some points with this. Um, this is a great, so this is a great looking setup here. It looks really fantastic on Blu-ray. Paramount did a great job bringing this classic out. So I got this 
this cool Paramount Presents line. They put out a lot of cool classic movies from yesteryear out for, for us to revisit again. It's a great set. See so you guys what it looks like on the inside. Um, some of the artwork in here of inside the sleeve. So take out the disc, you know, regular Blu-ray of it right there. And you get the inside of it right here with some imagery from the film, things like that. And here's the back of it up there, a little bit better uh, detail right up there. But yeah, great, great movie. Yeah, let me some ghosts. Tear jerker, but you know what? It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. But these movies come out next week, next Tuesday, July 21st. So I wanted to show, show you guys that and kind of share that with you guys right there. You're gonna look out for these. Link down below if you wanna get these titles at and more. Right, that's it for my video right there. Quick little fun video, just me just you know, talking about the, the rad upcoming Friday the 13th Blu-ray box set put out by the Scream Factory line. I can't wait. They always do an amazing job. This one looks like they hit a home run with it. It looks absolutely amazing. Definitely can't wait. So let me guys know again if you guys are gonna pick that one up. If you guys do, maybe act on it quickly because it, I don't know, it's limited. So I don't know if it's a sell out or nothing like that. I'm not really sure. The price could go way up. Who really knows? You never know. But anyway, um, yeah. So if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment below. And I'll catch you guys later on the next video. So I'll see you next time.